And whose is this? It's mine, Chef. And first name? Dewberry. Blueberry? Dewberry. Oh, Dewberry. Yes. This is what? It's a baked spaghetti. Uh-huh. I thought, oh my god, he's gonna kill me. It's completely overcooked. Is it? That's just like children's food. Really bad. Thank you. Bloody hell. It's mine, Chef. Chris. Executive Chef. Executive Chef. Executive Chef. Could you just explain to me what it is? Salmon roast on a plank of cedar. I think you're a plank. Well, I don't really know what that means, Chef. Plank means an idiot. Why is it raw on the bottom? Well, it's medium rare. That's how I would eat my salmon. No. You need to clean your glasses. It's raw. I don't agree, Chef. Let me tell you something and listen to me. You've got a lot to learn. So be a good plank and get back in line. Thank you, Chef. Michael, he hadn't said anything to any of his team. Then all of a sudden he just put his head down and he turned around to them and said, You guys cook like old people fuck. And I thought, my God, uh, that came out of the blue. You know, I wouldn't expect something like that to come out of his mouth. Yes, Chef. <laughs> Thank you, Chef. Can you get his attention, please? Two salmon well chef. done. Can you just shut the fuck up for 30 seconds? Absolutely. Two salmon well done. One lamb, one Wellington. Yes, yes we yes, chef. Yes. Can we just get some olive top and olive? Let's go. Just ignore these bimbos. Hey, Scott. Yes, sir. Yes. Two salmon well done, yes? Nobody will listen to us. Wondering where fucking food is. Do you get it? Service and standards are far more important than some fucking bimbo. I'm Why not. would anyone say shut the fuck up? I don't know. I mean, that's like... And then they told the people back there to ignore us. It's so impolite. Hi, how are you? Great, thank yeah. you. Yeah. We've been sitting here and... Yeah. It's the Red Kitchen, Chef. You're waiting on a Wellington and one bass, yes? Well, I'm deeply, deeply, deeply sorry, but right now we're about seven tables behind. That doesn't do much for me. Yeah, right. Can I just say, you do fuck all for me either. What do you want sorry. me to... You do nothing for me either. I just don't understand why it's so difficult to serve some people their food. Are you that arrogant? You haven't got a clue what's going on behind me? It seems like you have a lot of amateur sous chefs. Right. Don't... Finally, your head's coming outside your arsehole. Now sit down, you fucking dick. What an arsehole. Nothing upsets Chef Ramsay more than when customers come to the kitchen. Oh, my God. Lambas, yes? Got five minutes. Oh, no, no, no. Lamb bass, I want it fucking four minutes. I, yes, I'm not doing it as you please, Jeff. Yes, if chef. I had to listen to you all night long, no one would get served. Yes, I'll chef. do the lamb if you can't do it. Yeah, come here, you. Come here, come here. What? Do you know why? Because you're just all over the shop. You're just it doing it to suit you. Look at them out there. Look at those tickets. I understand, Chef. Move yours! Yes. Yeah. You're going to go then? You're going to run? No. No? I'm going to finish out service. Oh, really? Why? Because I'm not a quitter. You're not a quitter. <laughs> You're not a fucking cook either. Good. You're an asshole. What was that? What did you just say? What are you waiting I want you to say it louder. I want you to say it louder, Chef. I want you to say it louder, Chef. What did you say? Okay. You don't like me. I don't yeah. know what to tell you. You're an asshole. That's not cool, Jeff. Unbelievable. That is not fucking cool. Oh, I've had enough of you. Hey, Ralph. Good job here. How are you? Jean-Pierre? If you call me one more time, Jean-Pierre, I'm gonna kill you. Chris. Yes, sir. Come here. You're an executive chef, right? Yes, chef. Yeah? What do you think of that? It's a, it's a little fucked up, chef. There you go. There you go. Up. Chris. Sorry, I told you fucking earlier. Hello? Are you new it's fucked up? Yeah? And an executive chef doesn't serve shit like that, do they? No, no, you, you apologize. Don't do, do it again, okay? Oh, no. And then I'm like, and then what this oh, my was in my oh, mouth. Oh, so no, that's... no, it is plastic. Is Did you allow me to remove your plate? Absolutely, yes. yes. But everything was good and tasty. It was good. Uh, Michael, I had yeah. one lady. When she tried the pumpkin, it was a little plastic. They're fine, they're fine. Yeah? Sorry. All right, you get one time, and then I'll kill you. What's the, what, what's the complaint? Okay, let me point the chef out, and it could have been dangerous, yeah? I'm happy you didn't swallow it. Because that's... I don't need that tonight, believe me. No, no, yeah, just do that. Little piece of food. Yeah, okay. Oh, fuck it out. Yeah. Come here, bring that to me. 
Jessica. Yep. Without any lip, okay. just keep it shut. Okay. Customers found a big piece of wood in their lobster. That's not bullshit. No one's exaggerating. It's a splinter in the lobster, OK? Terrible. Stupid video. Elsie is making the rounds with her table side cart. Uh, here you are. Enjoy. And Jean-Philippe is making sure her customers are happy. How's everything? But I've never had a Caesar salad where they had the stems. Uh, usually they have the leaves torn off. And yeah. I, don't, I don't really like it. Okay. It's the stalks. No, it's fine. I'm just fine. Uh, what did your mom cut the, what, like, crust off your bread? Okay, Elsie, you know what you got there? What? You have there a pain in the neck. A gentleman who wants his lettuce to be cut. You cut his salad like a little baby. He just wants to be an interesting jerk, and he's not. And you cut his salad like a big boy, and then you put it back on, the, on, on his plate. Hi. Would you you'd like your lettuce cut up? I can do that for you if you like. Not a problem. I'll be right back with it. Mr. Lettuce Cutting, I started to cut it, you know, and I felt like I remember cutting my son's meat for him, you know, and I... I, I it took every bit of me not to say something really sarcastic, but, you know, service with a smile. It's no different than requesting your steak medium rare versus well done. It's how you like it, it's how you like it. So it doesn't right? hurt your feelings, Elsa. Not at all. Not at all. What do I have to finish Jessica, my... let's go. Yes, okay, sir, I'm on it, Jeff. What do I have to finish my... Okay, one pass, salad, one pass. This bath is full of fucking love. Chef, that is love. For you. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. You are a rock today, aren't you, Dewberry? Yes, chef. You are Gibraltar. You are the Hope Diamond. I'd rather you be saying I was Brad Pitt's wife. <laughs> He's got issues. Can you not just see Andrew right now, what's going on? When I'm talking out and reading an order out, let me read the order out, then you say, what is the matter? I need six minutes on the hot plate for that halibut. They're not cooking fast enough. I don't want to give you raw fish, chef. Hello, young man. Yes, chef. I'm trying to liaise both kitchens together, and this has turned out to be a nightmare. If I say three minutes on the hot plate, it's three minutes on the hot plate, OK? It wasn't difficult to poach the halibut. It just wasn't about to get done in four minutes. It just was, it's not chemically possible to cook that halibut in four minutes. Bottom line, science doesn't allow it. Whose is this? Andrew, Chef Ramsay. Andrew, step forward. And what is it? It's called Andrew's Absolute Penne. Andrew's Absolute Penne. Correct. That is absolute dog shit. Have a little taste. Could use some salt. You think you're smart, yeah? I have my moments. And how long have you been cooking? About 10 years. What a waste of 10 years. Get back in fucking line. <laughs> Whose is this? It's mine. There's nothing cooked. I love end dives. I thought 45 minutes in the kitchen would come up with something a little bit more exciting than that. It's very boring. It has additional pepper added. Chef, come here. One's got all the lobster in, one's fucking missing lobster. Get it even. Let's go back in the pan and get it even. How can we have two spaghetti on the same table? One plate has got no lobster in it, the other one's rammed with lobster. Work that one out, Jeff. Chef Ramsay's addition of Michael to the red team is already paying off. Say thank you, Mike. Say thank, thank you, you, Mike. Thank you too much for somebody who's never been on a fucking line before. Jeff, do you want him to cook your meat for you, Jeff. too? What do you want me to do? I've never been on a fucking line before. I'm doing it. I'm trying. Are Jeff. you fucking talking to me right Jeff. now? Are you? What is going on? I'm Jeff, trying come the best here. I come can. Come here, come here, you. I'm doing the best I can. Don't start I've shouting. never been on a line before. Right, okay. I'm doing Stop the best shouting. I can. Stop shouting. What are we waiting on? I'm working on that uh, spaghetti right, right now. Move your ass and get it done. Dear, oh dear, Jeff, oh we're here to help you. You don't talk to a chef like that, OK? Michael, you've got a risotto with a tuna. Nothing more. Who's Move chef? your ass. Main course, three Wellington, one salmon. After frustration in the red kitchen, Chef Ramsay turns to the blue kitchen in search of good news. Seven minutes, Wendy, let's go. Got it. Why is the spaghetti not in there yet? The water's not at a rolling boil. The water's not boiling. Did you top it up with cold water? Yes, Chef. Why did you put cold water in there? I thought cold water was supposed to boil faster than hot water. What? 